Hello everyone, my name is Anur. In this video, I'm going to show you design of G plus 3 building Turo code or Ethiopian standard in ETHABS. Okay, there is ETHABS used G plus 3 which is reinforced with concrete structure. ETHABS used in design in the Menarek step by step as I actually Okay, as you can see, this is the uh, architectural drawing of the structure. So you had the whole structure ETHABS used, but Allah uh neat design madrek in the mention as i actually okay therefore before directly uh going to etabs for us it's important to know some important data that help us to uh design this structure okay so let's see data which but then kadman mawak in or binar matno katasa structure and design come madrek okay uh jemmeri amin dino nazi important data which mawak giddi lanal malatno okay min dino function of the structure uh, this structure is a student assistance building. So, as it amari which la talaya service mita kombat hence ano malatno. Therefore, location of the structure is in Ethiopia at this Ababa. Okay. So, as it function of the structure mau kamendo now category classify adrigan live load ka euro code. We mdomo ka Ethiopian code standard live load la mau sir. We mdomo la mata kamita kmanal malatno. Location of the structure is in Ethiopia. Ethiopia is location of the structure. What is the importance of knowing the location of the structure? This, this classification is important because we can easily understand in which zone the structure is uh, found. Okay. Therefore, seismic zone is working. Simply, we can take the kick ground acceleration. Okay. In our case, the structure is located in seismic zone. Therefore, for seismic zone, in Ethiopian building code standard, peak ground acceleration is 0.1 g. Okay, soil type B. This uh, data comes from the uh, geotechnical investigation. Therefore, bearing capacity uh, of soil 300 kilonewton per meter square. Here we will take a moment to know just for designing the foundation. Okay, well. Uh, uh, type B and no zigaramu air to kekwem demo seismic analysis la masratim mita command part no malatno. Well, concrete string is used for column, beam, and slab C25. Serti already metakotno concrete uh, string is lemon demitakam. Steel characteristic string is uh, S450. Diameter of the longitudinal bar is 16 mm. Diameter of the transverse bar is 8 mm. Concrete clear cover 25 mm. Concrete cover to longitudinal bar. Center are and mm no. Uh, therefore, dimension of the column is 400 by 400. Nazi preliminary dimension nacho. According to our uh, design, we can here We can increase or decrease. Okay, the size. Leila dimension of the typical beam, which means floor beam layer no 300 by 400. Dimension of the grid beam 200 by 300. Which means 200 width, 300 depths. Okay. Thickness of the slab is 150 mm. This is calculated from deflection requirement. Live load in the classification is 4 kN per meter square attack manual. Wall load or the partition load that rests on the beam, which means line load, 10 kN per meter. Okay. Uh, Partition load, which means area load, equals to 1.5 kN per meter square. Okay, we have to know the difference between the line load and area load. So let's see, uh, line load mallet, beam line, uh, and the line uno acting mirror kN per meter, no area signal demo band area ust in minor uh, load bar meter square band meter square ust in minor mallet. No, okay, therefore, uh, this partition load is uh, so let's see, uh, the uh, panel ust the partition load. Practically, and the metal to the architectural in the now from panel to panel, the partition load is different. Okay, yilla ya nager ganiziga for the illustration purpose. So on the tutorial, uh, we have assumed that all the panels or the uh, rooms have the same partition load, which is 1.5 kN per meter square. Okay, floor finish. Uh, this is also area load, two kN per meter square. Okay, here nanta rasacho kalkuit madre chila lacho. Uh, next, because uh, the uh, important data I mentioned, no, yeah, architectural, uh, floor plan, elevation, section, but then we might have to make Okay, uh, so as the guys you mentioned, no, plan which one we need to make Therefore, the ground floor plan is here, for Okay, 
therefore እዚጋ እንደምታዩት አርክቴክቸራሉ በደም ባይታይም pdf ስለሆነ ማለት ነው ነገር ግን እዚጋ እንትን አድርጌዋለሁ እንደ አዲስ ሪድሮው አድርጌዋለሁ ምንድነው important ነገር እዚጋ የሚጠቅመን የgrid spacing እና number of grid classify ለማድረግ ነው okay እንደምታዩት here the x direction if this is x direction and this is y direction a b c d e ያለስ ከ h grid አለ okay ስለዚህ በy direction 1 2 3 ያለ ከፍሎታል okay this is important however አንድ አንድ ጊዜ cantilever አለ እዚህ ጋር እንደምታዩት okay እዚህ ጋር ደግሞ slab አለ ስለዚህ የነዚህ grid ማወቅ አለብን ለምን ነው grid ካስቀመጥን simply beam እና slab draw ማድረግ እንችላለን okay ሳንሳሳት ማለት ነው therefore ይህ grid architecturally default ያለ grid ምን ማድረግ አለብን ማለት ነው edit ማድረግ አለብን okay for example here እንደምታዩት እቺ cantilever 1.2 ወይም ደግሞ 120 ሴንቲሜትር ወጣለች okay therefore 1.2 ከሆነ ከ face of the column ነው from the center of the column 0.2 ስትጨምርበት 1.4 ይሆናል ይሄ 1.4 ሌንግዝ መካተት አለበት okay ምክንያቱም ይሄ beam ለመሳል ማለት ነው okay therefore ከዚህ ጋር መጀመር አለብን a b a ይሄ a value ደግሞ ወደ b ይያልኩኝ መሳል አለብን therefore እዚህ ጋር እንደምታዩት grid spacingው በ x direction 1.4 ከዛ 3.5 ከዛ 2 a 3.5 ያለው የትኛው ነው ይሄ ነው ማለት ነው this length okay up to this ከዛ 2 ያ 2 ሜትር ይሄ 2 ሜትር ያለው ደግሞ ይሄን አከባቢ ማለት ነው በዚህ አርጉ ከዚህ ወደዚህ ጂምትየር ማለት ነው okay እያለ ይከጥላል generally uh, since spacing አለ ማለት ነው በ x direction 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay by y direction the same cantilever ካለ cantilevero ማንኛውም ነገር include ለማድረግ grid በስትክክል መከፋፈል አለብን 0.5 0 0.8 5 1.945 5.5 ያለ ማለት ነው okay እንግዲህ uh, typical story h ደግሞ 3.23 ነው foundation column ነው ወይ ደግሞ story uh, height of the uh, foundation 2 meter ነው okay well ሌላ ደግሞ first and second floor ነው second first and second floor typical nacho they are the same therefore grading system um and ayinat no selezi qedem izi ga endemtayit ye y direction nezi cantilever include lemadreg no okay ye cantilever endemtayit totally this cantilever uh, 1.3 no okay distance selezi ye 1.3 uh, grid lemattakalen ye 1.3 no lela demo izi ga migaba here we have small cantilever okay balcony is this length is uh, 0.5 nacho okay Uh, 0.8 ናቸ ይሄ 0.8 ነው ይሄ ደግሞ 1.3 ነው ስለዚህ ይሄ ዲስታንስ እንት ነው ማለት ነው 0.5 ስለዚህ from this to this 0.5 from this to this 0.8 from this to this 5 from this to this 1.945 from this to this 5.5 from this to this 1 meter okay this is the grid ስለዚህ 0.5 0.8 5 1.945 5.5 1 0 ስለዚህ number of grid in y direction 6 ይሆናል ማለት 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay ይሄ ደግሞ third floor ነው እንግዲህ the same ነው third floor ከ second እና first ሚላዩ ምንድነው እዚህ ጋር cantiliverዎች disappear ሆኗል ይሄው ይሄው ማለት ነው okay ስለዚህ ይሄ እናንተ ስራ ይሆናል ማለት ነው architecture ያለው በደም ማይት ይኖርባችኋል ማለት ነው ኤሌቬሽን ሳይድ ፍሮንት ቪዩዎች እንዲሁም ሴክሽን በደንብ መታየት አለበት ማለት ነው ኤቭሪቲንግ ኢንክሉድ ለማድረግ ወል ሩፍ ፕላን የመጨረሻ እንደምታይ this is the roof plan okay እዚ roof plan ላይ ምንድነው መጨረሻ ላይ ተጠቀሙት ሩፍ ቆርቆሮ ነው ስለዚህ ኢጋሺት ሩፊንግ አለ ከዛ ትረሱ ደግሞ rectangular hollow section ነው እንደምታይት perlin በ1 meter spacing ተቀምጧል still ደግሞ በ already በ እንትን በ architecture አሉ መሰረት እዚህ ጋር mono pitch ነው መሃል አካባቢ ደግሞ dual pitch ነው እዚህ ጋር ደግሞ mono pitch ነው okay እንደምታይት ይሄ የሚፈሰው ተፋሰሱ ወደዚህ ነው okay this is to this side and this to this side okay therefore here we have one truss which means dual pitch truss ጫፍ ላይ ደግሞ እዚህ ጋር ደግሞ ወደዚህ የሚፈሰው mono pitch ትራስ ይኖራል እዚህ ጋር ደግሞ ሞኖፒት ትራስ ይኖራል ኦኬ ኢን this uh, tutorial we are not going to model this stress uh, with the structure model አናረጎ but it is important to model it ነገር ግን እዚህ ዝም ብለን ሞዴል ሳናደርግ the reaction 
ከትረስ የሚመጣ ሪአክሽኖችን ወደ ስትራክቸሩ አፕላይ እናደርጋለን ማለት ነው ዘርፎር እዚህ ጋር ምንም ማወቁ አሪፍ ነው ነገር ግን ሞዴል አናረጋው ሌላ ጊዜ ከፈለጋችሁ ግን ሞዴል ማድረግ እንችላለን ማለት ነው አብረን ትረሱ ከስትራክቸር ጋር ሞዴል እንዴት እና ምን ዳርግ እና ያለን ማለት ነው ኦኬ ናው ሌት አስ ጎ ቱ ኢታፕስ ኦኬ ወደ ኢታፕስ ንሂድ ጎ ቱ ኢታፕስ ኦኬ ሄር ኦሬዲ ኔ ከፍቻለሁ ጎ ቱ ፋይል ኒው ሞዴል ኦኬ ዩዝ ቢልት ኢን ሴቲንግ ዊዝ ይመጣለ ኦኬ ስለዚህ እዚህ ጋር እንደምታዩት ያስመርጣችኋል ዲስፕሌይ ዩኒት በማን ይሆን ይያለን ነው እናንተ ደስ ያላችሁ መጠቀም ይችላላችሁ የስ ካስተመር ያለ ሜትሪክ ኤምኬኤስ አለ ሜትሪክ ኤስ አለ እኔ ይሄንን መጠቀመው ማለት ነው ኦኬ therefore still section database euro ተጠቅመለው እናንተ ደስ ያላችሁ መጠቀም ይችላላችሁ still design code euro code 3 እዚህ ጋር still አንሰራም ነገር ግን ከፈለጋችሁ ትራስ መናምን ሞዴል ማብራችሁ ካደረጋችሁት ይሄም ሰሌክት ማድረግ አለባችሁ የፈለጋችሁት ኮድ መሰረት ማለት ነው ኮንክሪት ዲዛይን ኮድ ዩሮ ኮድ ቱ ይወለው ማለት ነው ኦኬ እንደምታዩት የግሪድ ዳይመንሽን በፕላን እና በስቶሪ ዳይመንሽን ሰጥቶናል በዚህ እንጀምር ለምሳሌ ዩኒፎርም ግሪድ ሲስተም ነው እዚህ ጋር የሚሰጠን በኋላ ነው we can edit okay by ourselves okay what are the number of grid line in x direction okay previously i ten wall this is 10 okay number of grid in y direction 6 okay spacing of grid in x direction here engedi edit mid direction it is not uniform ballebet into okay uh, story height bottom story height 2.5 no yentnu ye typical demo 3.5 to 3 okay okay number of story ka entin selem yareglen for nilo alen ihe malat no okay okay now endem tayet ihe ngidi uniform grid system no nya men madregalleben edit madregalleben right click add modify grid milalle okay ezi gat matallachu majemeriya story data check nargo okay base like zero blotal ene gen mifelgo mindinno here ziga negative 2.5 okay ziga 2.5 slow story one edit argut ground value ground floor first floor second floor third floor okay ingri zi ga roof yikaral malatnu selezi min naragalen right click add story keep story height zi ga 3.23 number of added story and insert above third story from existing server story okay so let's see proof and balance let's see make sure that elevation is finally 12.92 mamtat allebet malatno okay ye architectural emi asayen endezi no okay so let's see okay bilen notalen let us edit grid systems okay ezi chiga modify show grid system milalle click ezi ga display grid data as ordinate similalle let us take this display grid data as spacing okay len emikalen ye slowana no nante be ordinate mutakam chilalachu okay now let us insert the values of spacing a sent nebere check na dergoski ndemtayit x be x direction 1.4 3.5 2 5 4.5 okay ያለ ይቀጥላል ኦኬ 
3.15 0 what about y grid data مجمرة 0.5 0.8 0.9 5.5 اوكي كذا 1 متر سلازي ليلا يقرال معناتنا اد نبلو 7 نو ميونو معناتنا ايه 1 متر هون معناتنا اوكي اوكي اهون تشرسن اوكي بلا نوتا اوكي سلازي ناو نيكست ستيب ميونو مندنو ليت اس ديفاين ذا ماتيريال ماتيريال بروبرتي جو تو ديفاين ماتيريال اد نيو ماتيريال ريجن ميلو ني كا يورو نو متاكمو يوروب Let us define the concrete. C2530. Okay. Let us use the default values. Okay. But the best default value in the tagam. Okay. Okay. Let us define the steel. Add new material. Europe. Material type. Steel. Standard. 1993. Okay. EN European norm okay S450 Okay let us use the default value of this material property Okay 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 now let us define the uh, columns and beams go to define section property frame sections Okay Here uh, there are uh, sections uh, that are defined by default. So here we have concrete beam and concrete column. Okay, let us uh, modify this uh, concrete beam. Go to uh, modify and show property. You can also add new property. Okay, for my case, I'm going to modify this. Okay, here change this into typical beam. Typical beam. Okay, material. C2530, okay. Dimension, depth 400, width 300. Okay, so now let us modify the reinforcement. Modify, show rebar. Okay, make sure that the design type is beam. Okay, cover to long thinner rebar group centroid 41 according to the given data. Okay, longitudinal bars change this into S450. For the confinement, also 450. Okay, now let us modify the property stiffness, which means stiffness. Here, change this one into 0.5. 0.5 torsional constant 0.1 moment of inertia about two axis 0.5 0.5 about three axis okay what i'm doing here is i'm considering the cracked section okay cracked section consider the other rock magnetum a beam a tension a meshakam selemachir concrete beam uh bottom part kulle mindino miyaregu crack yaragal matna therefore i'm supporting to miyakel cracked section now we are going to say I'm supposed to a section which are your concrete section of participate me are going to be able to do almost compression zone yellow you said I can go back to know you yell can you load more than okay and I'm working for lazy 0.5 I don't know okay okay now let us define the grid beam okay 
uh, instead of adding a new property, let us modify the property of this typical beam. Okay, add copy of property. Okay, grid beam. Okay, dimension three hundred by two hundred. Okay. Lelaw reinforcement na property according to typical beam no miyono malatno. You can check it. Okay. And then we type ziga is four hundred fifty. Makayro machara labet. Okay. Ziga modify show property. Okay. And then we type no. Okay. Now let us define the concrete column. Concrete column, you can add new property or you can modify this existing uh, default section. Okay, therefore, modify show property. Gavalo Ziga column and lo material C2530 dimension 400 by 400. Sorry. MM no here, okay. Section shape concrete rectangular no okay. Reinforcement modify narc, modify show river. Okay, make sure that the design type is P M2 M3 design or column here is the Zablotal Malatno. Okay. Therefore, uh Ziga clear cover for confinement Yalano. Uh this is 25, okay. 25 according to the given data here, reinforcement. S four hundred fifty are good. S four hundred fifty. Okay. So in Mikaro Lila Nagar, you can uh, take it as default to Knatum, Wala Kadizan, Wala Mr. Kakal, uh, Solovana Malatno. Okay. Rasu, area of steel, corporate Argo Sela Misat and Malatno. Okay. Now uh, we have already uh, completed. Uh, defining the frame sections okay which means the uh, typical beams grid beam and column okay okay now let us define the uh, slab section go to define section properties slab sections here we have a default uh, slab section let us modify it or you can add new um, property okay for me i'm going to modify this property modify just write slab slab material which means the concrete material c2530 modeling type shell team we have other options shell tick membrane layer okay so for uh, solid slabs with shell tin okay the difference between those modeling type uh, i will uh, make a video on this so here i'm not going to talk de detail about it so um the thickness of the slab is 150 mm according to the given data okay so type property type here you can use other drop stiff ribbed waffle but for our case we are going to use slab okay uh, another here uh, there is a modifier okay so currently default, we can modify this one. This uh, stiffness must be uh, modified, okay? So in this case, like the beam and the column, we are considering another, uh, the cracked section, okay? So this is 0 0.05, 0 0.05. Membrane in F11 direction, membrane F22 direction, membrane F one two direction bending m1 one direction 0 0.05 this also 0 0.05 membrane m1 two direction 0 0.05 okay the remaining will be as it is okay 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 now we have completed defining all the uh, sections which means the column beam as well as the slab okay next we are going to uh, draw the uh, column beam and slab 
let us start first by drawing the columns okay so let's see column lemasal uh, first uh, we have to uh, change this into all story okay this one here we have all story similar story therefore change this to all story this means in one click we can draw a column in all story okay therefore here in the drawing option we have different options to draw a column therefore you can use this draw beam or you can use quick draw beams column or you can use this quick draw okay i'm going to use this one quick draw quick draw columns in plan or 3d okay so let's see make sure that this uh, one window is active in a plan view therefore this is in a plan view roof line below therefore uh, let us select the uh, column quick draw here property option in milala here column now i'm telling maybe grid beam you know chill out still beam you know to carry it all that you want to be able to therefore in your column to let me go make sure that this property option is column okay now let us start uh, drawing the column therefore column in line that they architectural guy that you mock to let you know check in our god let us go to the architectural and then the title ziga axis uh, b lay ziga axis b for lay and column all kaza d for lay and column all kaza e yale engidi in kullum column ich aitachu qas begas kullun draw madreg alleben malatna okay now let us go to tabs selezi mindeno minarego ziga ziga column all as you can see here and click sinar mulu ne salen okay all stories la adaragno malatno okay keza ziga and column all Okay, now uh, we have completed drawing the column. So let's see. Okay, next draw madreg ala bimano. Beam, okay. So let's see. Beam draw la madreg. Uh, typical beam na grid beam na lin. First, let us draw beam in all stories, okay. All story lai. Bala bat beam draw na madreg na. Kaza next, ye grid beam select madreg na. Property ma kai range la lin malat na, okay. So let's see. Let's see chigat. Matalachu, draw beam metro click. Zichiga, a steel column in Milala property, change this steel column to typical beam. Okay. Selezi, Ziga, beam. Now let us uh, draw the uh, solid slab.
okay now let us draw the uh, solid slab okay to draw the uh, slabs you have here option draw floor wall draw rectangular floor or kick draw okay let us use kick draw first rectangular bonoga as the property d1 change this to slab okay press action select arrow quickly you can draw slab Now we have completed drawing the uh, solid slab. Next, let us draw the cantilever slab. Okay. To draw the cantilever slab, we have to also draw the cantilever beam. Okay. Okay. Now let us draw the cantilever beams. Remember that uh, the ground, the first, second, and third story, they are different. The first and second are typical. The third is different. The ground is different. Therefore, what we are going to do, let us uh, draw in all story the cantilever beams. Then we are going to edit okay like what we have done for the slabs and the beams okay therefore let us uh, here uh, use kick draw beams okay let us draw here we have uh, cantilever beam here we have cantilever um, or let us see the uh, architectural drawing okay here if you see this is the first and the second floor uh, plan here we have cantilever here we have cantilever here we have cantilever also here we have okay and here also we have cantilever. Here we have cantilever of 0 0.8 meter. And this is uh, 1.3. And here we have uh, 1.2. Therefore, we are going to draw this. Okay, in all the story, then next we are going to do it because here in the metal side ziga, this is the first and second floor. Okay, in the third floor, this uh, part. It's not available here okay we don't have any cantilever here so we are going to delete it first let us draw in all story okay okay now let us draw here Okay, now let us draw the cantilever slab, okay? Okay, you can choose uh, draw floor. You can use draw rectangular, you can use kick. Okay, let us use kick first. Make sure that the property is slab. okay now we have completed drawing all the slabs the beams column country beam country slab okay but now we have to edit okay we have to edit according to their architectural plan okay now let us go first to the plan mode go to the base okay here in the base we don't have any slab okay therefore we have to delete to delete this one make sure that this is one story okay if you if you make it all story by one click or by one delete you can delete all slabs or beams okay therefore let us change this to one story okay select select
edit delete okay ground floor ground floor in the ground floor also we don't have any slab okay delete edit delete okay delete okay what about first and second let us uh, look to the architectural drawing okay this is third floor let us uh, see the first and second first and second floor they there is a cantilever here there is cantilever here between g and h between h and also there is cantilever here there is cantilever here there is cantilever okay so what about the third story in the third story the cantilever in gh and hi they will be deleted okay therefore let us go and delete them go to the third story and delete this cantilever edit okay when you select uh, members make you can see here okay here you can read two shells eight edges selected okay ምክንያቱም አንድ አንድ ሌላ ነገር ሰለክት አድርጋችሁ ለታጠፉ ይችላልላችሁ ሳታውቁት ማለት ነው ድሪክ ስናደርግ በደንብ ኬርፉል አድርገን ሰለክት ማድረግ አለብን delete okay sorry we have deleted in the roof but make sure that this plan view in the sub floor okay two shells eight edges selected edit delete okay what about uh, roof plan roof plan slab me ban neger yellem you don't have any slab okay go to the roof select select beam select in that tarago check adrugo okay okay 21 shells 75 edges menin beam ibal neger selector adaragnum delete okay uh, now uh, finally we are going to edit the ground uh, floor okay go to plan ground floor okay let us compare this uh, drawing with the architectural plan okay this is the architectural plan okay as we can see this is the uh, ground floor plan therefore uh, clearly we can see in the uh, etabs we have uh, cantilever beams here but here uh, in the ground floor we don't have we have to delete this one next here the uh, beam uh, length is, is um, extended up to 3.5 meter okay therefore 3.5 meter by 1.945 grid beam should be uh, drawn here uh, another here we don't have any um, cantilever beams and those should be deleted uh, another here we have secondary beams that are extended in the uh, in the two directions therefore we have to know this distance and this distance okay this distance is according to the architectural drawing is 2.5 which means uh, 5 divided by 2 okay this center and this distance according to architectural drawing is 1.55 which means one third of this 4.65 okay now let us go and edit this in etabs 
okay now uh, let us uh, delete this uh, make sure that this is one story delete this beam okay now let us draw another uh, beam typical beam next we are going to change to grid beam okay by selecting all members for the time being let us draw this okay now let us select this and this join edit go to edit edit frame join frames okay now this is one beam okay next here we have to uh, delete this cantilever okay delete delete also we have to delete this one okay now we have to draw the secondary beams here okay first let us the distance of uh, this part is 1.5 which means one third of uh, 4.65 let us divide this frame into three okay edit edit frame divide into three apply okay let us check okay let us divide this into two let us check yes now we have create joint okay now let us draw okay now let us select the two members go to edit edit frame divide break at intersection with selected frame okay let us delete these two members Okay, now let us draw this beam. Now uh, we have completed editing. Okay, now let us assign the grid beam. Okay, if you uh, see this uh, beam, it is a typical beam. Okay, so let's see. Here, typical beam. No, right click the madrek uh, assignment material lachu section property typical beam. But grid beam assign madrek madrek but therefore select target all member. So let's see, select. Select Argachum. Go to Assign Frame Section section property grid beam apply okay 
okay go to assign clear display assign okay here uh, we have uh, three beams one two three okay let us join them select our canal go to edit join frames okay Lela, we have here also two beams let us join them edit join yeah, and natural. Okay. now we have completed uh, the modeling uh, of the structure now let us uh, assign the jointers go to plan base select all joints assign joint restraints fix it okay apply as you can see the pin support change it to uh, fix it okay now let us uh, view the modeling okay go to set display option view by color of object into section property extrude frame extrude shell apply okay let us uh, close this window okay as you can see uh, we have properly uh, define our section and we have modeled it correctly okay uh, okay let us see this in a rendered view go to view show rendered view okay we can rotate and see everything okay okay uh, here in the ground uh, floor uh, we have to draw a beam okay here we have to one uh, beam that we forgot to draw next uh, I think uh, let us rotate this uh, structure Again, here we have uh, two beams, okay, that we have to draw, okay, okay. Now let us uh, go to uh, plan, ground, okay, go to draw, draw beam, change this property from typical to grid beam because we are drawing a grid beam. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, in this uh, plan view, we can. Uh, see that this cantilever grid beam uh, is uh, its color is different from this this means previously when we are selecting we missed selecting this member okay let us check it so this is typical beam let us select and change it to grid beam okay select select five frame frames selected assign frame section property grid beam now everything is okay go to assign clear display assign 3d go to set display option extrude frame extrude shape apply okay now we can see that the structure has been modeled correctly okay okay uh, this is all about the tutorial for part one next video will be part two okay 
In part one, we have seen how to edit grid data, how to define material as well as sections for beam column slabs, and we have seen also how to model the whole structure, how to draw beam column, how to draw slabs, and how to edit them for each story according to their architectural drawing. And we have also assigned support, which is fixed support at the base of the structure, okay? The next tutorial will be part two, which is we are gonna assign loads. We are going to define loads. We are going to define load combinations. We are going to assign rigid diaphragm for the structure. And also we are going to um, assign mesh for the slab, okay? This is uh, all about the part one. The next video will be part two. Thank you for watching.